You already know what time it is. It's time for more Skyrim. Man, I've been thinking about this game a lot since that last video. I know it's been a few days since I've uploaded, but and we you know we've played The Witcher 3 since then. But man, we're really getting close to the end here. I, I don't know how long it's going to take, but I do plan to finish the DLC in this episode, at least the main story. I know there's probably some other extra stuff you can do, but I want to beat the main story of, of Dawn Guard today. Um, I know some people are saying I still have some stuff left, but we're going to get it freaking done. Hopefully we can finish it in this video. If you guys are hyped for more of Skyrim, you already know what to do. Hit the like button for your boy and leave a comment for the algorithm. You know, it really helps your boy out. And of course, subscribing will keep you notified for whenever I go live with more new episodes come out. And of course, it'll help us get closer to our goal of 50,000 subscribers by the end of summer. Without further ado, this is Skyrim. All good. All right, let's head into Bone Chill Passage. I was playing Roblox and a kid called me poor. Now look, look him in the eye and tell him, no you. Uh oh. Who's there? Don't worry, I got this. I got this. You know I heard something. No, hold up. Hey, how about you go and fight her, bro? You're nothing to me now. I barely got hit by him. Sorry, these guys still scare me. It's called trauma. I need you guys to understand. Hello? <laughs> it looks like me when I have to leave my room. I feel that. Is this really where I have to go? I guess so. It's down here somewhere. Dude, I need to save up for new PC parts too. Heavy armor increase. We take those. We take that. Hold up. Knapsack. I'll take that. Excuse me. That's worth a lot of money. I'll take that. That's mine. What else is mine? Something else of mine around here, I bet. Leather boots. These boots is made for. Oh, oh. I'm going to be real. I barely saw him. Who the freak is this? Oh, Serana's bandit. I'm like, who is that? Oh, we have the last thing, so we can go and give that to her now. We already beat the dragon that was up here. Wait, what? Why are you here? Wait, why is why is the bandit able to talk? I haven't heard. I didn't know any of hers could talk. Revere, revered dragon. It just works. Todd Howard, we're having a talk after this. We're having a talk. Ooh. Pretty close. Too close for comfort. Oh, a finisher. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> and let's just say I do not think I don't think that we're going to have to worry about Mirak stealing our kills anymore. That's all mine, baby. Let's go. I'm enjoying Skyrim Elements of Rico a lot. That's mine. Dragon Soul Absorbed. First try. Uh, Dragon Bones. Take all that. Real, real talk. Again, I'm in the end game now. I can freaking throw away whatever I want to throw away now. Even though I still feel like I don't have a lot I can throw away for some reason. Wait, isn't there a potion that lets me um that yeah, wait, wait, strength carrying capacity increased by 30. 
<laughs> there we go. Okay, that lets me teleport back home at least. So I'll come back here, but I need to go back home. We've gotten ourselves in a peculiar situation. I believe it's actually down and not up. So I'm going to make our way to the objective point by going down this mountain in a very professional manner. As you guys know, I am Kingdom Ace. So that means I cannot fail as far as the video viewers are concerned, because I can easily edit out any mistakes I make. That was easy. Exactly. I need everybody in the chat who didn't believe me. To uh oh, ow. Bandit thugs. Actually, you kind of hurt for a thug. Let y'all get off me. Oh, oh my goodness. I believe in you, Ace. I appreciate that. Other dude is floating down the stream. I'll take that lockpick too. Give me that. I can use the tanning rack. Cool. Alteration increased. Dark elf. You guys are. What were y'all doing in this dark elf? What the freak, bro? Okay. Well, hopefully wherever I need to go is not up there, but around this corner. All right, F5 going in. How did you get here? Hello? Hello? Not very impressive, is it? If this ends up being a wasted trip, your friend Dexian and I are going to have some words when we get back. How about you tell me the words I do? Huh? All right, let's move. Also, hold up. And I forgot to hit the record button again. Okay, well, we got in here. Draw a knife. Well, we got the knife. That's now it? All we need to do is track down one of those canticle trees. You mean this one? Hope the moths like that bark as much as Dexian said they would. Uh, okay. Well, how do I... How do I attract the swarms? Look at them. They've definitely taken a liking to you. Oh, I and actually just go towards them. You're starting to glimmer. Hmm. See another one. Three. Well, uh, let's go around. Four, five, that's a swarm. Don't lie to me. Okay, I was about to say, don't lie to me. Was, is this where we came through? I don't, that doesn't look like where we came through, but this is definitely the area. Um, They won't mind the drop, will they? Woo! Oh, I got another swarm somehow, okay. And seven, okay. Enter the column of light and read the Elder Scroll. Oh, shoot, dude. All right, I'm in the I'm in. I'm in it. I'm in it now. And now I'll read the is it in book? No. Oh, yeah. Elder Scroll blood. Oh, shoot. They just read it multiple times. Don't you have a wife? Hold on. What's going on here? Bailey's got a great voice. Are 
Are you okay? Almost thought I lost you there. You went as white as the snow. Don't worry, I'm fine. I never trusted those damn scrolls. Who knows what those things could have done to you? Just look at Dexian. What about Ariel's bow? Do you know where we can find it? It's in a place called Darkfall Cave. Then it's almost over. We can finally put an end to this ridiculous prophecy. Where is this Darkfall Cave? Scrolls gave me this exact location. Get going. I want to get there before my father has a chance to track us down. Too late. Okay. Locate Oriole's bow. Okay. What was that sound? Whoa, something's up there. What the? Where'd you come from? What the freak are those things? See, you know, we we run from things like that. I ain't even come over in these areas. Oh, that actually that actually despawned the enemies. All right. Sounds like we're getting into battle. What the freak? Oh. Wanna kill Serana on accident. I kept seeing a low HP and it looked like her low HP. And I was like, dude, if I ended up killing her right here, that would fail the whole quest line. Who's shooting that? I see you. There we go. Oh, I got the vampire thing. Master. Oh, whoa, man. Resist shock. Resist magic. What else am I low on? Oh, whoa, I didn't realize how low I was again. Oh, crap, she's strong. That ma I, I am like, and I have resist magic stuff on. heal I don't have another heal I have fortify health I guess that's not the same thing but oh, I have an extreme healing I didn't even realize that mess me up a little bit i do need to heal my vampirism because i'm not going to be a vampire oh okay made sure i kept um one of those uh cure all diseases with me there some people are probably like no i want him to not remember it no Wait, what the freak? Did I come here originally? Yeah, it was like this. Completely immortal. I can't kill her. Because I know when some are immortal, I, like I can still like kill them on accident. Okay. Okay. 
Now we need to head to Darkfall Cave. Okay, I thought I would. Hey, at least we've been here. Which was great, man. Wonderful, even. Who's there? I knew I heard something. I'm going to ignore them. Have fun. It'd be pretty uh, crazy if another dragon showed up around here, wouldn't it? Oh, was that a wolf? You thought, homie, you really thought she was about to hit me. You thought you were going to catch me lacking just because I had the freaking healings out? Nah, play it. That's not how that works. It's not how that works. Darkfall Cave. Ooh. Mm. Long dungeon? I would get more. Okay. Well, yeah. All right. You're right. right let's freaking do that then. Where'd you come from? Stone. I in, in the middle of town, that uh, this guy just attacked us. That's crazy. Okay. Well, at least he didn't get into my house. All right. Wait, what was I coming for? I didn't even remember where I was coming for. Um, I need to wait for time and wait, is that my son? Dragon's reach is so it's 4 a.m. Cool. The there, there are bad guys and monsters out here. Get the brig home. Lars is such time a to go to bed. Yes, pa. Alfred. Crazy. Of the great clan battle board. Name, I'm sure Sophie, what the? Well. I played with the Lucy and the It's party. time for bed. Come on, just a few more minutes. Sophie. Yes, pa. It's 4 a.m. What is the freak of these kids doing out? Just because I'm not at home? That's crazy. Kids, man, kids. I'm in the cave now, and I just fell on something. I keep, this is why streaming games is harder because I keep forgetting to freaking turn on the recording. I'm scared of heights in video games, by the way, guys. If you guys didn't know that, I'm specifically scared of heights in video games. <clears throat> okay. Oh, what the freak is with the lighting just then? Oh, oh, sorry. I, I, sorry, I forgot that was you. I, I, my, that's my bad. That, that's, that's my bad. I'm sorry. You have a meta quest three. No, I have a two. Who's there? Show yourself. Why don't you take multiple? I've been poisoned. Wonderful. I got a, you're poisoned. Never mind. Another one? Hello? Quest three actually is way different than the two. The two, like the three has a bunch more AR technology. It definitely, like honestly, in my eyes, the Quest three is easily the best VR headset. The Quest three is absolutely worth it, even if you have a Quest two. I'd love to get one for myself. I have a friend who has one though. Hmm. Oh, there's actually something back here. I only kind of went back here on a whim. Chest. More gold, greater. Imagine, bro. Like, that's some life saving type of money right there. Up on beats for 3 20 a.m. Yeah, you did your duty. I appreciate you. Have a good one. Got any tips for a novice VR player? spend time in vr that's honestly like as weak weak as that sounds and no duh like that is legit the most important thing i can tell you mostly just because you'll never get used to vr if you don't play vr you know you, you gotta spend some time in it you know like like especially if you're somebody who gets motion sick there are a ton of different ways like a lot of times types of like movement are like teleportation and stuff 
in those games. So if you're somebody who's prone to motion sickness, you, you know, just play the game that way. These people were... Why would anyone want to set up camp here? Well, they had to. I wonder what happened. Don't worry, we'll read the thing. Nothing new? Okay. Uh, what did that say? It was the note, Darkfall Cave note. I, I read that? Sister, I know that you'll come find me, but we'll be too late. It will be too late. If you find this letter, get out of this Forsaken Cave as soon as possible. You're fools to think we could live so close to such creatures and live peacefully. I should be I should have headed back to camp with you after we placed the torches down here. I thought these trolls would be different that they would somehow understand that we didn't want to hurt them. I'm now cornered and it's only a matter of time before one of the trolls decides to finish me off. I hope it's a quick death. Farewell, my dear sister. Dang. I'm not somebody who's prone to headaches in VR, so I, I'm I'm perfectly fine with it, but I know not everybody is like that. You know, so if you're not like that, you need to. And if you're... And sometimes you need to find out if you are like that. So, and the answer to that is by spending time in VR. I see that trap there. Where do I hit it? Wait, I, I, I thought I, I would disarm it. What? Why would I activate that on myself? The only, you can only activate that by being in the way. This is not the right way, but I'm curious. Did I come from here? Yeah, this is the beginning of the cave, it seems. Or maybe that serves as a way out. I think the motion sickness thing only really feels that way because, you know, you, you're kind of putting on a device that makes it seem like you're moving. Your brain starts thinking you're moving, but your body knows you're not. Is she getting hit by the rocks? They're just sitting there. There you are. Yeah, but I, I'm just saying, I, I thought... I thought it would disarm it. Like, why? Why would who? Why would it be designed like that? Why would I want to activate the trap on myself if I'm going up to the trap and I see it? I would disarm it, not do it myself. Have you played Darn Guard yet? I'm literally playing it right now. Right now, I did Meridia Beacon already. And I did get the Dawnbreaker. I just don't feel like using that weapon right now because I have better weapons. Even if that weapon is good for what it needs to be. Dang, you got messed up. Watch out, Serana. Ooh. No, you're good, Rios. Yeah, VR is really nice. It's not something I'd, I'd use, you know, I don't use my VR headset every day you know, or anything, um, but I honestly, the, the quest is a great series, but I also know that if you're using it for Steam games and stuff like that, it's not always fully compatible or some some uh, VR headsets work better, I should say. Like the Steam uh, headset obviously works the best for Steam games. That's why it's so freaking expensive. You have nothing to fear here. Night Paladin. I am Night Paladin Gellibor. Welcome to the Great Chantry of Oriel. This cave is a temple to Oriel. Oriel, Oriel, Harkosh, Akatosh, so many different names for the sovereign of the Snow Elves. 
Snow elves. You're a Falmer? I prefer Snow Elf. The name Falmer usually holds a negative meaning to most travelers. Those twisted creatures you call Falmer, I call the Betrayed. I imagine you know why we're here. Of course. You're here for Oriel's bow. Why else would you be here? I can help you get it, but first, I must have your assistance. Blaze, if you really want to try VR, you want to really get into like a really good one, like, like you, like, like I'm telling you, there are some really good VR games, but there's also a lot of really bad ones. So you play a VR game that's like was made or to be VR, you know, like not these added on ones and stuff. Everybody can herald Skyrim VR and stuff like that. To me, mo the best VR games are the ones that were made to be VR. Like if you really want to do it, especially with what you got going on, on your channel, play freaking uh, Walking Dead Saints and Sinners. It's got a great story and it is probably the most immersive, like <laughs> freaking uh, VR games I ever played. It's pretty freaking scary, though. I'm not going to lie. It, 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 I'm not going to lie. It's pretty freaking scary. Me and Bruce have also both played it, so we'd be able to talk with you about it. They actually came out with a sequel. Like, dude, I'm telling you, when you like have to open doors just a little and creep up the stairs because you hear something in there you can grab the the zombie's head and just use a knife kind of like what you've seen in, in telltale's walking dead you could do the same thing grab their head and do that or hit them in the leg to knock them down and stuff like literally everything you think you can do you can do in that game it's so freaking crazy i am knight paladin Gallop. oh we already did this Audio. he timed out the dialogue like the first, those twisted creatures you call yep. of course I can help you get it, but first, I must have your assistance. What kind of assistance do you I need? need you to kill Arch Curate Vertha. Oh, it's Half-Life Alex is also incredible, too. Who's your brother? Why? The kinship between us is gone. I don't understand what he's become, but he's no longer the brother I once knew. He mm. was betrayed. They did something to him. I just don't know why Oriel would allow this to happen. So wait, wait, is his brother? Oh, okay, no, 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 never mind. Swept into the Chantry without warning and began killing everyone without pause. Didn't you fight back? The Chantry was a place of peaceful worship. Video viewers are so mad right now. I was thinking the same thing. I'm not going to lie. No match for the betrayed's sheer numbers. They slaughtered everyone and stormed the inner sanctum where I believe they corrupted Vertha. Whenever I talk about things that don't have anything to do with what's going on right now, I know they're mad. It's like, day. <laughs> that's my bad. No, 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 you're good. You're good. Guys, I, I am paying attention. Believe it or not, despite talking and looking at chat and stuff, I, I, I was paying attention. I promise you. He's alive. Don't click off the video. I've seen him, but something's wrong. He never looks as though he's you're good, in pain or under duress. Don't apologize. Just stands there and watches as though waiting. If you tried getting into the inner sanctum, the way shrines unguarded would be violating my sacred duty as a knight paladin of Oriel, and an assault on the betrayed guarding the inner sanctum would only end with my death. True. Yes, let me show you. Wait, I need a drink, buddy. Well, I just joined it, so I'm not gonna lie. Video viewers might might get mad because, like, he's not even paying attention. You know, and, and honestly, I'm not going to lie. If I was a video viewer, I might feel the same way, too. I'm not going to lie. I, I always prefer the Let's Plays when they actually kind of do stay, stay on topic, you know, but I don't necessarily mind if they're talking about like, oh, I'm playing that, too, you know, and for transport when the Chantry was a place of enlightenment. Prelates of these shrines were charged with teaching the mantras of Oriel to our initiates. What's that basin in the center signify? Once the initiate completed his Trying to get a thumbnail. He'd dip a ceremonial ewer in the basin of the Way Shrine center and proceed to the next Way Shrine. So these initiates had to lug around a heavy pitcher of water. Marvelous. There. How long would they have to do that? Well, once the initiate's enlightenment was complete, he'd bring the ewer to the chantry's inner sanctum. Pouring the contents. Oh, that's a good that's a good screenshot. The sacred basin of the sanctum would allow him to enter for an audience with the arch curate himself. All that just to end up dumping it out? It makes no sense to me. It's symbolic. I don't expect you to understand. It's a cultural so thing, Serana. We need to do all that nonsense to get into the temples so we can kill your brother and claim Ariel's bow. I know how it all sounds. But if there was another way, 
I'd have done it long ago. The only right. way to get to my brother is by following in the Initiate's footsteps and traveling from Way Shrine to Way Shrine, just as they did. The first lay at the end of Darkfall Passage, a cavern that represents the absence of enlightenment. How many more Way Shrines are there? There are five in total, spread far apart across the Chantry. These caves must be massive. Caves? Oh no. The Chantry encompasses far more than a few caves, as you'll soon discover. But before I send you on your way, you'll need the Initiate's Ewer. So I need to... Initiate's Ewer. I, I need to fill this at each way Once shrine. Once you've located a way shrine, there'll be a spectral prelate tending to it. They will allow you to draw the waters from the shrine's basin, as if you've been enlightened. I'll be off then. This may be the last time we're able to converse. If you have any questions before you leave, I have no I questions. Suggest you ask them. I have Otherwise, no questions. All I can do now is grant you my hopes for a safe journey. And he walked away. Any chests or anything out here? I don't have the Witcher senses to really see if there's anything here, though. So, actually, what what's over here? I bet you this is the way out. Oh, where, what? How did you get over here? All right, well. Questions. I expected as much. Wrong. Interest in PvP like Apex Legends or Rust? Probably not for videos. I thought it would be. Kind of soothing, actually. I feel a little warmer now. I wouldn't mind necessarily streaming some stuff like that, though. Run, run. Where'd you come from? Oh, and just in general. Oh, uh, well, yeah, I mean, I'm pretty into like uh, shooters and stuff like that. I'm not too big into battle royales, though, um, so I'm, I'm not too into Apex like that. I was more of a Titanfall guy, um, but what the? You come from? out of here. That'll teach you. But if I'm playing a shooter right now, it's probably. Oh, yes. Harvest Blood. Yes, now I have everything for Septimus. Cool. Um, if I'm playing a shooter now, it's probably either Rainbow Six Siege, Valorant, or um, I knew I heard oh. <laughs> um uh, probably Star Wars Battlefront now, <laughs> because the classic collection just came out. <laughs> Poisoned. Freaking. Fighting my toes. There we go. They don't even look the same. Oh, I got you, I got you, I got you. I'll take that nine gold. Love Siege, I love Siege, man. It sucks because my Titanfall 2 just won't work anymore. I don't know why, it just legit doesn't work. I can't even launch the game properly, it just crashes. Done and done. It sucks, I might have to try to play the game on like Game Pass or something. I think I've decided to dedicate my life to Game Pass because... Oh, whoa, you can actually go down here? Whoa. There's nothing down here, but wait, there is something down here. Where did that just take me? Uh, dark passage, dark fall passage, note one. I'll take that ultimate healing and that resist fire. Elven arrow. 15 arrows. Rod of resist fire, coin purse. Only dropped everything. Elven bow, I don't need that. I kind of got a better bow. I guess we'll read the note. Read the note. Dark Fall Passage Note 1. I made it farther than I thought, but I'm afraid I can't go on. I choose not to. I'm content to die here in this quiet little room alone with my thoughts. The creatures won't follow me here. No more danger. The silence is welcoming. Well, when it's the end, 
and you're kind of limited on what you can do and where you can be, I guess that's not so bad. Every man has a right to choose how they go out. Oh, I was like, huh? Eh. Okay, that's the way we came from, I believe. So where's the route we go to? No, this is definitely where we came from. Now we go through this way. Stay at the ready. I hear them. What is this? It's definitely a trap. What the freak are all these sounds? I guess there was nothing to worry about. And he's dead. <laughs> uh, want to break over here. Stop sending me this way, that way. Wait. Oh, is that a way to skip the trap? What? Wait, why would... Serana. Why would... There was no trap there, though. We all... They just walked through that fine. Oh. Take that. I'll take that. That's like a tanning thing. Mmm, I like the squirming sounds. Hello? Oh, I see him. I guess if I was an archer, it'd be good to be right here. Okay. Nope, nope, nope. Wait, aren't I poisoned? There we go. I'm going to cure that and that just in case. It'd be good though. All right, well, you continue taking them on while I go and take some of these, take some of those. Those are mine. Those are rightfully mine by birthright. There's nothing in that other place. Mm. Shadow Master. What you got? I don't need that frost thing. This is a chest? What? A lot of music bumping still. Oh yeah, what's in here? Nothing? Is there an enemy still around? I don't think I went into this one right here. Yeah, I don't know what these things are supposed to be. Alright, that's obviously the way to go. But I'm kind of curious. There's something behind it. Oh, whoa, this waterfall. All right, well, I'm not going to worry about that then. Looks like it can go around anyway. Don't see him. Oh, there is just something else back here. Wait. Okay, yeah, I can go. I can go back. Hello? Uh oh, that sounds like a trap. Oh, crap. Where am I getting shot from? That didn't sound like a person. this was the right way to go was it i feel like there was another way there yeah there was a whole nother area i kind of just ignored it who's there what the freak oh he got armor armor on dang 
He just punched me in the face. I love I love the wind shear because you can do that. Okay, I'll take some of these. Why not? Whoa, what the freak just happened to me? I'm over here. There we go. What is this thing? I don't know what that middle thing is supposed to be. And check the houses. There's a chest here. Shield of major blocking. That's kind of fire. I'm not going to lie. That's kind of fire. I wonder if you I can uh, disenchant that. Wait, what? So what does this do? Nothing? I think it's just a set piece for uh, what happens if you uh, can't pay your phone bill on time. Okay, wait, where did I just come from? Definitely didn't come from this way. Hello? Thanks, Max. Appreciate you. To me. Ah, I can see. Off me. Get off. Get off. Get off. All right, they're dead. They're dead. Okay. Is he dead? Oh, it just works. Yeah, I can literally loot him. Yeah, he, uh, it, uh, it just works. What's up, Mac? Dude, I don't even know. I don't even know where I'm going anymore. I'm kind of just exploring. Who's there? These things don't hurt. Uh oh. <laughs> Enchanting table. Though I don't have too much to enchant right now. Teach you. Okay. Oh, that's all really that was in here. Let's go back this way. Wait, what did I say? I tried to do something about it, but I, I pressed the wrong button. I didn't really get hit like that, though, so. Hopefully this all winds together. All right, it's Mosey. Be careful here. Whatever's on the other side of this, Palmer wanted to keep it there. Hmm. Where'd you come from? <laughs> I'll teach you. Yeah, he didn't even do anything to me. I honestly feel bad. What? 
Poison Bloom. Whoa. This place being small, uh, big is an under understatement. Like, what the freak, dude? I don't even know what I'm doing, per se. This feels like an overworld. It's literally like the Underdark, yeah. Someone said to uh, use fire on like one of these things or ice. They probably meant it for something specific. Never saw anything like this back on the island. I'm not, not in Kansas anymore. Yeah, this looks like. You know, when you go into the underworld, like in Tears of the Kingdom. Whoa. Bale Deers. Is that the name of this place that we're in? The Vale? Makes me think of Orm Vale in Final Fantasy XIV. Except with less poison. Homie, homie looking like he's late to clock in. Uh, okay. Okay. I guess this is... Sorry, buddy. I need your eyes. Get them soul gems, that's mine. Hmm. Oh. Who are you? Welcome, Initiate. This is the Way Shrine of Illumination. Ah, yes, I need to do five of these. Prepare to honor the mantras of Ariel and fill your vessel with his enlightenment? Sure. Then behold Ariel's gift, my child. May it light your up, as you seek tranquility within the inner sanctum. This is one of the quests in Dawn Garden. May Ariel's brilliance illuminate your path. Thanks. Draw water. Okay. May Ariel's brilliance illuminate your path. All right, I guess I just bring that with me. I have no idea what you're talking about. I would rather not know until I find out myself. Hello? Caves. Caves. Cave dweller. Huh. Down there looks kind of nice. But I doubt we're supposed to go down there. Where did I just end up? Forgotten Vale. Huh. Well, that kind of makes me want to go down there, just in case. Wait, I don't, doesn't look like there's much of a way back up, though. Hmm. This must be that beautiful Skyrim weather I've always heard about. I'd rather you not let me fall off. Well. Okay. All right, let's go in a direction. You're right, there there was quite a bit left still. Honestly, even if I didn't finish it in this stream, I would literally just like end the recording and then just like start up again like tomorrow and just continue on and just edit them together. 
That's the power of editing. Mm. Oh, 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 chill out. Chill out, buddy boy. Oh. I like it here. It's serene. Uh oh, they already see me. Are they all in like forgotten caves? No, nah, I don't think this is where it's telling me to go. Like, I don't think something is specifically in here. No, telling me the objective is still out there. chest or nothing in here wait that is a chest though wait well, do I have time to be going on getting distracted right now I don't know what that did I actually do have clairvoyance, so it might be a nice thing to use right now. came down no. what the freak is that a monster yeah. mine mine uh i didn't expect this Okay. He'll be okay. Is that what that was all that was in here? I guess so. That that was odd. Okay. Well, I knew that wasn't for the objective, but don't we all just feel a little bit warm and fuzzy inside now that we sated our curiosity? I know we all feel warm and fuzzy. Oh, yeah, someone said use clairvoyant. Uh, right here. It is nice that you can do that. I haven't used clairvoyance too much because it's kind of nice just hoping I'm going the right way, you know? But now that I have a lot of magic, I don't really have to worry about it. At least my magic region specifically is pretty good. Hey, buddy. Welcome, Initiate. This is the Way Shrine of Sight. Are you prepared to honor the mantras of Ariel and fill your vessel with his enlightenment? Of course I am. I was already ready to say then yes. Behold Ariel's gift, my child. May it speed your journey to the inner sanctum. I just came across the first episode of the series today. Have you tried any mods yet? Or does it recommend simple HD texture mods? Honestly, I don't really use mods because honestly, I don't feel the game really needs it. You know, I feel like 
at least as a a new player I, I feel like it's just been really enjoyable to not use mods i guess that makes sense. i mean i have some mods on like i don't have texture mods like i still have um i have stuff like unofficial skyrim patch i gave the merchants a little bit more money um and i let myself run while sprinting wait so i don't need to go back there right Yeah, now that I've gotten it, I don't need to take that portal. If that was my last one, I would use the portal. Now I got to go and find the other ones. Honestly, that's probably what I'm excited about most. Not even really doing like other guild quests or whatever quest lines. I'm more excited for a different build, something really different than before. I know everybody's like, oh, don't do stealth archer. Everybody does stealth archer. But, I mean, my first playthrough, I didn't do that, so... Oops. I have not played any other Elder Scrolls game. This is my very first Elder Scrolls game. This is the kind of thing that you want to see. Makes everything else worth it. Really? Does it? I feel like we've been going through it. I feel like we've been going through it. I see it up there. You've reached the way shrine of learning initiate. Are you prepared to honor the mantras of Ariel and fill your vessel with his enlightenment? I'm not going to lie. Clairvoyance makes this super freaking easy. Ariel bless you, child, for you are a step closer to the inner sanctum and everlasting wisdom. That's kind of the point. That's the only bad part about this freaking wolf's tail. Like if a certain part of my head is itchy right in the middle of it, it's like, ah, I gotta dig in to scratch it. May yes, but when will I start Mass Effect? As soon as Skyrim is done, I'm, I'm honestly like counting the days. I'm, I'm super excited for Skyrim. Mostly because, dude, we have nothing sci-fi on the channel. And anybody that knows me like in real life and stuff knows like sci-fi is like my my lifeblood. Like I, I'm super into sci-fi. I love they fantasy and stuff like that, of course. Like I, I've, I've, I honestly are arguably experienced more fantasy stuff than sci-fi stuff at this point. But I, I adore sci-fi. So I'm really excited to get into space and stuff, especially if you guys watch the No Man's Sky videos. You guys know I'm a big fan of space stuff, bro. Of course, I'm also a fan of third person shooters and stuff, too, and I'm really excited to play something really different on the channel. You know, like we're playing two fantasy action games on the channel right now. So while they are very different, um, while they are very different from each other, I'm, I'm still playing two fantasy games, right? You know, so I'm excited to dive into Mass Effect. I'll be reacting to the trailers first, by the way. And just what I usually do, you know? How mass is your effect on a scale of one to seven? It's a 700, baby. Oh, is that a troll? What the freak? Oh, man. Uh, I might need the wind shears for this one. Okay. Yeah, 
There we go. Amethyst Paragon? Whoa. Giant's Toe, Gold 300. They definitely give you some good stuff. Homie had boots and a shield, and he was not using any of it. Extra weight, but I don't need it. If I need to throw this away, I'll throw it away. Um, back to Clairvoyance. Sorry, guys. When I when I see a monster, sometimes I feel like I gotta take it on. You know, he could two hit you. Well, now he can go and two hit something else from beyond the grave. Hello. Hmm. Oh, there it is. I see it. Let's move. Let's move. Commander Ace. Dude, I'm so excited to be a uh, shepherd. I know you could pick like uh, a male character. Or a female character like as like Shepard. You've arrived at the Way Shrine of Resolution. Yes. Then go forth, child. May the enrichment of Ari El strengthen your resolve as you undertake your journey to the inner sanctum. I'm no fan of the sun, but it would be better than this. This is our fourth? Yes, fourth. Whoa, whoa. Learning? Oh. Okay, wait a second. May Ari El's glow shield you from your enemy. Thanks. Oh. Through here? Okay, I didn't expect that. What is down here, though? Ah, it doesn't look like anything, actually. Guess the last one is all the way up. Well, to be honest, I don't really use magic that much. I used to be more of a spell sword um, when I was uh, earlier on in this game, but kind of done the old sword and shield thing. I should use Molag Ball for this. There you go. Give me your soul. There we go. Hmm. I have played Borderlands. The only stuff I like is Star Wars, Halo, Terminator, Predator, and Borderlands. You can play some more, uh, you know, play and watch some more uh, sci-fi. Even though those are major things that I like to. Even though I haven't experienced Halo. Oh, wait. It's inside there. Well, here we go. You can use clear size to get rid of the snowstorm. That's pretty cool. kind of strong. Psych. Definitely know what Sovereign Guard is at this point in the game. <laughs> 
That's crazy how it still tells you where to go. Clairvoyance is kind of crazy. Oh, whoa, I didn't realize how low I was. I just, I just literally wasn't paying attention. I was just hitting. I was going in on him, giving that one two. I was going in. I was not thinking. I'm not gonna lie, his friend definitely didn't die jumping off that cliff. He's definitely still alive down there. Would you do that? There we go. Meme clipped. Hey, clip all the funny moments of the streams and stuff you guys want and put them in the Discord server. I want to get into making YouTube shorts, but I'm bad at knowing if something I said is funny or if something that happens is funny. Cyberpunk is definitely sci-fi. Trying to quick and blow them off, but it's crazy that I don't have my shout back. I think I still have the speech one on. I'm gonna tell you right now, Cyberpunk is nothing like Star Wars. Well, I mean, I guess if you count that one episode of Mandalorian, then maybe where the guy kind of had upgrades and stuff. There was like the, somebody out here. He's like an upgrader. He upgrades people. I've not seen the new Dune movie. I've seen the first one, though. Let me put on this shout one. Who's there? We're too weak to use my shout on. Nothing else over here? Okay. Mm, Cyberpunk is definitely closer to Cowboy Bebop, surprisingly enough. 
Well, actually, I heard they just canceled that open world Mandalorian game. They just announced it and legit a week later, they they canceled it because uh, I mean, there's a I'm, I'm telling you guys right now, you guys might not know it if you guys aren't like into social media like that. But the gaming industry is in a terrible spot right now. Everybody gaming costs so much to make, but they're not using the money wisely. The game, like the, the products don't reflect the amount it costed to make them. And I, like legit, we're on the verge of another video game crash. Legit, the only the only other video game crash we ever had was in 1983, where a very similar issue was happening, where so much was on the market, but the money wasn't coming back, you know, in, you know, for it, you know? So it's like, we're legit on the, the cusp of getting another one of those. If another video game crash happens, gaming will not be the same for the next couple of years. Like, there could even be a, a spot where, you know, there just won't be any major games at all for the next couple years, if that happens. That's why it's like, that's such a very dangerous thing that can happen. Most people watching the stream might not have been into gaming at that time. I mean, heck, I wasn't alive back then, but, but still, there's more than enough stuff out there, research and stuff, you can look up about it if you wanted to. You didn't. You didn't get blown off. I accidentally let it go early. Andor was very good. I I enjoyed it a lot. Yeah, it got canceled. I do have it, but I have I don't use it. I would love to get into the Deus Ex game because I know like people love the original and stuff and Mankind Divided was like the last really good one we had or last one we had period. But I'd love to play it. Apparently the KOTOR remake is actually in development again. I'm telling you it's a mess. It's a mess right now. Let's get indoors. It's not just Star Wars stuff that's going through this. They're also, I think they're shutting down or or, or stopping updates with uh, stopping updates for uh, the MMO as well. Finally, not because it's doing bad. They just they Who's think there? they just need to cut back. She's going to hit that. I hit that. I would love to play through the full game of the original. I only really watched my brother play uh, KOTOR. But I would love to actually like play it myself. And I, I was younger when he was playing that too. So I would love to play it for myself and actually know the real story. How about you stop? How about I stop you right there? I'll take those. Nope. 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 What does that mean? Is it beneath? Like here? Who's there? No. Why? Oh. Hmm. They're just not having enough magic. Is that what that is?
Why is why is it not working right? I don't fully know where to go here. Hmm. Definitely where to go is definitely up. All right, well, I'll just go as up as I can. Like, why is it doing that? Like, what's what's wrong with the spell? Did I check this already? Did not. Okay, this was this way. Okay, this is definitely where we needed to go. Dude, it, it just did not want to tell me that's where it was. Get off me. Done and done. God, I'm on the PS3 was so buggy. That's where I first tried playing the game. And I was just like, bro. I can't play this game, bro. This game just don't work. Like where a trap would be. Just works. The infinite loading screen, bro. I legit was like, I just want to play a little bit more before I go to school. And it was on the loading screen. I was like, it's taking this long? Because sometimes it took long, but like even a couple minutes. But I was just like, all right, uh, I, I just leave it there and just, I'll just sit there, you know? And I left it loading. I came back from school. Tell me that joint, that joint was still loading, bro. When I freaking came back from school, man, that was crazy. Oh yeah, this weapon is not charged. Uh, we don't have our black star. I think it's because we haven't been killing humans with it. I'm sorry for playing it on PC. Playing it playing on PS3, I'm sorry. We made it through. Who decided to put this here? You found the Way Shrine of Radiance Initiate. Are you prepared to honor the mantras of Ariel and fill your vessel with his enlightenment? Yes. Yes. May the blessings <laughs> of Ariel protect you as you climb the road to the inner What's up, Fiona? and final enlightenment. Good to see you as always. I loved Force Unleashed as a kid. May Ariel's radiance fill your heart with joy. Gain entry to the inner sanctum. May Ariel's radiance fill your heart with joy. Cool. Has to be the place. I've never.
never seen a building like that before. It looks like some kind of temple. By the flood. This reminds me of that one area in, in Wind Waker. I won't spoil, but for those of you guys that are fans of Zelda, you know what I'm talking about. Hmm. Hello. This is a statue of Orion, but it's using the older signs of his power. This temple must be ancient. The bow has to be in here. We've come a long way, Serana. Or all the water. Is it, is it done? I poured the water. Okay. Is it just not done? Okay, yeah, it wasn't done. Okay. I didn't realize it was flowing and all that stuff. There we go. I guess you might need to resist the cold here. Okay, well. Good thing I've got one of these. Don't mind me. I'll take all of this. That too. Pick that. Pick those. That's mine. That's mine. This is all mine. Activate the Shrine of Oreo. All diseases cured. Well, okay. Thanks. Hmm. Doesn't tell me anything. Activate the altar. Uh. Oh, Elven sword. Okay, well. Wait. I figured you might break out. That play make Trioc. Huh. Thunderbolt. Kind of fire. Coming to life. Y'all just be leaving this crap around here, bro. Oh me that slump. Iron flesh? Hold up. Hmm. No direct path theme. That's actually interesting. Okay. Dang. Y'all be holding the good stuff in here. Give me that. I don't remember when, uh, what, like, kind of school I was in. I know I was younger. I actually played the Wii version. I loved the Wii version. It was great. I liked how, like, each version of the game had, like, a different mini game or, like, a different mode to it. Whoa, different path. All right. Excuse me. Ah, I'll take those. I never have too much stuff. All right, well, that's just an end path here. Dude, I'm not gonna lie, adding that sprinting or uh, jumping wall sprinting mod is probably the greatest thing I ever did. Oriole's Chapel, oh. 
I'm loving Skyrim, Harley. Play the DS version. I forgot there was a DS version of that. What the freak, bro? I remember there was a PSP version. The PSP version was pretty cool. It had like a flashback mode to where you can like do iconic fights from the from the movies, but like be Star Killer instead. And that was only available in the PSP version. Did you really come here expecting to claim Ariel's bow? You've done exactly as I predicted and brought your fetching companion to me. Wait, is he talking about me? Which, I'm sorry to say, means your usefulness is at an end. Uh oh. Where'd you come from? Found your channel across, uh, came across the channel the other night. Watch your stream video of, first stream video of it. I enjoyed every second of it. I'm, I'm half new. I'm ha half <laughs> being attacked. And I'm glad you enjoyed it though. I know. It's always fun watching somebody uh, play a game you like for the first time. Uh, Serana. Uh, let me do this real quick. Um, Cure Poison. Dang, y'all got some meat on the bone. There we go. Uh, we should charge the weapon too. All these common soul gems. Don't want to stay too long as I myself haven't played this amazing game and don't want spoilers. You haven't played this. That's actually pretty surprising. Thanks, boys, but I hope you're having an amazing stream, bud, and, and hope everyone here enjoys the rest of your evening. Hey, appreciate that. Hope you have a good one, though. An impressive display, but a wasted effort. You delay nothing but your own death. Watch out! He's coming down the ceiling. You, you tell me to watch out and you get hit by it. Oh! To be fair, for a ceiling, that didn't hurt as bad as I thought it would. Is he going for the ceiling parts I'm nearby? I should have used fire breath. Back too much on him. Okay, hold up, hold up. Ah. There's probably gonna be a final boss of this, so I kind of don't want to waste something specific, but. How many parts of the roof do we got? Uh oh. Okay. Uh... Mm. 
Or is this cold? Let me get a little bit of magicka. Stop going through the rocks, please. Ugh. Hey, what are you doing? Are you, are you okay? Hope to catch a Witcher stream soon or recording for us. Both are great. Oh, you'll get one. After Skyrim, but you'll get one. Yeah. I was definitely getting jumped. I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna lie. I'm getting jumped. I can't bring out any of my stuff. I I can't. I can't bring it out. I guess we're in a story mode. Give us the bow. How dare you? I was the arch curate of Ariel, girl. I had the ears of a god. Until the betrayed corrupted you. Yes, yes, we've heard this sad story. Gelibor and his kind are easily manipulated fools. Look into my eyes, Serana. You tell me what I am. You... You're a vampire? But Ariel should have protected you. The moment I was infected by one of my own initiates, Ariel turned his back on me. I swore I'd have my revenge, no matter what the cost. You want to take revenge on a god? Ariel himself may have been beyond my reach, but his influence on our world wasn't. All I needed was the blood of a vampire and his own weapon, Ariel's bow. The blood of a vampire, Ariel's bow. It was you? You created that prophecy? A prophecy that lacked a single final ingredient. You. The blood of a pure vampire. The blood of a daughter of Cold Harbor. You were waiting all this time for someone with my blood to come Dang. along. Well, too bad for you. I intend on keeping it. Let's see if your blood has any power to it. Uh, oh. Where'd you come from? Uh, there we go. I knew we were going to have to fight him. Whoa, I'm being pushed back. Whoa, did he kill me that fast? Whoa. I didn't expect to get murked like that. Dang. Enough, Arthur. Give us the bow. Ah, uh, and of course we gotta hear this whole thing again. No, no freaking way! I didn't just record that. No way. No way. I didn't record that. Okay. I have the flashback recording for a short. I did press it. So for that part, I might try to edit that in. F5. Okay. No way does that kill him. No. No, no freaking way. I didn't just record that. All right, I actually reloaded the save to see if I can do it again. Okay, so what I I did unrelenting force, and I hit him once, and then I went. <laughs> what the hell, dude? That, that's so crazy that that could happen. <laughs> the fact that you can. <laughs> they legit just didn't think about that, dude. They legit did not think about that, unless they completely meant for you to be able to do that. <laughs> that is crazy to me. That's so freaking crazy.
Man, oh my gosh, dude, that's so crazy. So the deed has been done. Oh, you came back. The restoration of this way shrine means that Vertha must be dead, and the betrayed no longer have control over him. The betrayed weren't to blame. What? What are you talking about? He was a vampire. He controlled the them. Vampire. I see. Uh, that would explain much. Definitely gonna stream the second Side. game. It brings me joy that the betrayed weren't to blame for what happened here. Why? Because that means there's still hope that they might one day shed their hatred and learn to believe in Oriel once again. It's been a long time since I felt that way, and it's been long overdue. My thanks to both of you. You're welcome. You risked now? everything to get Oriel's bow, and in turn, you've restored the Chantry. I can't think of a more deserving champion to carry it than you. If you wish to learn more about the bow, or obtain some hallowed arrows for it, I'd be more than happy to help. You've but to ask. Wow. Oriel's bow. Somehow... Wait, so don't I need more Please arrows? take the bow. It's yours. Wait, didn't he say if I Farewell. needed more arrows? If there's assistance I can provide, just ask. Huh. That's weird. It's the least I can do. Farewell, friend. May the radiance of Oriel fill your heart with joy. It's not as shiny as I was expecting. Still, it's beautiful. That was a very long quest. I think we both know. It's time to face my father. If we don't, he'll keep chasing us for the rest of our lives. We do, he'll have to die. I've been thinking about this for a long time. It's... It's not easy. But I don't think we have much of a choice. No. This has to end here and now. And let's face him together. Head back to the castle and kick the front door in. We're gonna be knee deep in his friends. Let's head back to Isran and let him see what we've got first. I'm betting he'll lend us a sword or two. All right. If there's anything at all I can help you with. You said you needed arrows. elven arrows. If there's assistance, I do can the provide, what? Can, just ask. It's do the, the what can you tell me dialogue? Oh. The bow was said to be carried by Oriel himself into battle against the forces of Lorcan in ancient and mythic times. Its craftsmanship has no equal anywhere within Tamriel, and possibly beyond. What can it do? The bow draws its power from Aetherius itself, channeling it through the sun. Therefore, when an arrow is loosed from the bow, it produces a magical effect very similar to being burned by fire. Can you upgrade the weapon? Like, can I go to, like, to, uh, white, uh, white run and, like, go and upgrade That's it? That's actually only a fraction of its potential. With sun-hallowed arrows, you would be able to produce a much more spectacular mm. effect, causing bursts of sunlight to envelop your foes. The sun bursts would certainly hurt anything, but is especially devastating to the undead. Using well, blood? Well, using an arrow with the bow that's been dipped in blood may cause it to function differently corrupting its purpose. That's, of course, if you're foolish enough to try it. How do I obtain some hallowed arrows? I actually assist you in that regard. If you were to bring me some good quality elven arrows, I could imbue them with the proper incantations and rituals. Can you make me some? Absolutely. I can only do 20 at a time. So if you want the rest of your arrows blessed, let me know. Okay, cool. Can I have more? Absolutely. I can only do 20 at a time. So if you want the Dude, how many did I have? Answer, certainly. I can only do 20 at a time, but I see that won't be a problem in this case. Okay, yeah, I don't have I'm any afraid more. I'll need elven arrows if you want me to produce the sun hallowed arrows. What is she doing? <laughs> and it seems you're all out of them at the moment. All right. Well, This is where it wants me to go. We did it. Dang, dude. 
That was a that was a great uh, dungeon though. I felt like it, it went on a little long, but it was still uh, good. It definitely had a nice payoff. Um, where the freak am I going? Ah, uh, Fort Dawn Guard. How I miss you so. Hello, Isran. The bow. You have Ariel's bow. We need your help, Isran. Indeed. The day hasn't been won while Harkon still walks Tamriel. But what of Serana? Can she be trusted to lift a blade against her own kind, her own family? I trust her to do the right thing. I suppose that's as much as I can hope for. Let me address the Dawn Guard, and then we'll be off. The men deserve to know that we finally gained the upper hand. Everyone, gather round. Come on, then. We haven't got all day. What's up, everyone? We're all here. Are you going to stop talking? No? Why are you looking at me? I knew it would come to this one day. I knew. Well, at least you're smart enough to want to learn more. I'll show you what I can. Wait, what the freak? Do I random? Oh, oh, oh. I just spent like a whole Watch bunch of money. Oh, oh, no. Oh, 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 no. No. No, I gotta hear the cutscenes again. No. No. Do your things and rest well, my friend. We meet outside Castle Volgahar. All right, that was a riveting conversation. Let's go ahead and keep your eyes open. All right, time to go and head out. Oh, wait, is he with me right now? Oh, everybody's here. Well, we're obviously going to teleport. We'll meet you there. These dudes going to run all the way there. Uh, hold on. Maybe we should we we should check first. We need to buy stuff because this might be a hard fight. Dude, we can actually upgrade the spellbreaker. Legendary. Dude, wait, what is it? What is it like? Oh, yeah, I want to see what it, it normally does. Hold up. 50 points. OK, 84 man. That's nice. Oh, yeah, we also were able to upgrade Oriole's bow to legendary. I, I, I thought we weren't able to, but we definitely can. That's cool. All right. Now it's time to take the fight to them. OK, Optimus, let's go. I guess we are taking it to them here. Dude, we're not playing around, bro. <laughs> what killed me so fast? Can I get out? Oh, he's a sentinel. Please don't let me hit a teammate. Okay. Took. Take all that. Let's move. Let's move. Oh, 
Give me that soul. Give me that one too. Armored troll talk? Why did y'all come all the way down here? Who are we beating up? Okay. F5. Oh, they're already going in. Elsta, you're not a dawn guard. But I don't I can't tell who's a vampire. I don't want to kill a teammate. I can't tell. Like you're you're not an enemy, right? You're a you're a vampire, I could tell. Uh oh, Ooh, it's a battle royale for real. Bro, if you don't back off. Whoa, someone is hitting me from behind, pause. Oh, who is actually hitting me? I can't tell. Someone from above? Saw that. We didn't really get to explore this area fully. Wait, you're 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 a dawn guard. You're a dawn guard. You're not. Pull up. They don't mind if I take a take a little minute to do this real quick. I'll take that too. Why not? Master. Okay. Oh crap. Oh man, I don't even know if I feel like doing this right now. I don't know if I feel like doing this right now. Oh, well, what's it in me? There we go. One less monster in the world. Okay. This leads here. Okay. Dude, I'm really freaking hungry right now. No, I didn't want to do that. Didn't want to do that. There we go. Serana, my hey, it's not too good, Chess. Oh. I see you still favor keeping a pet. You know why we're here. Of course I do. You disappoint me, Serana. You've taken everything I provided for you and thrown it all away for this pathetic people. Provided for me? What's Interrupting the cutscene, I know. I'm sorry. Babe, you've destroyed our family. You've. Wait, how do I? Other vampires all over some. How, how do I? Well, hold up. How do I switch what arrows I'm using? Because I want to do the the regular. I want to do the See, the special can... arrows, of course. Um. Oh, I could always just go here. There. I understand. No more. I'm done with you. You will not touch him. So, I see this dragon has fangs. Your voice drips with the venom of your mother's influence. How? A no. Because unlike her, I'm not afraid of you. Not anymore. And Peak. you. It appears I have you to thank for turning my daughter against me. I knew it was only a matter of time before she'd return with hatred in her heart. Hatred born of your neglect. 
A small price to pay for the betterment of our kind. Your kind is a blight on this world. Yes, yes. Always the noble vampire hunter. And what happens when you've slain me? Is Valerica next? Is Serana? Mm, I would never harm Serana. She's too important to me. I'm only here to kill you. This is more than killing vampires. Mm. Then my daughter is truly lost. She died the moment she accepted not harm and Sarama into her life. Enough of this. Yes, quite. I'm growing weary of speaking to you and my traitorous daughter. I'll give you a single chance to turn over the bow to me. There will not be a second. Very well. N never. Very well, then. You leave me no choice. Bring it on, old man. The flesh ah! from your bones. Dang. Whoa, that's fire. Where is he? Okay, back to doing this. Oh, he's up there. It doesn't do as much as I thought it might. Is he not getting hit by it? has sufficient charge. Well, that looks like something I need to use the bow on. I definitely just hit Serana with that. Come on, stop moving. We'll level up. Okay. Um, I still do not have. Dude, he's taking no damage. He's definitely healing off me. I don't have time to be fooling with this thing. Honestly, I'm going to use this real quick. Hmm. Let's just focus on this. It ends here. Come back here. Hold up. Wait, there's one thing more. You turned her against me. Wait, 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 wait.
There we go. <sighs> I'll rend the flesh from your body. You can't hide. You cannot stop the problem. Yeah! Yeah! Oh. Oh, that's Serana's gargoyle. I keep doing that. You can't hide from us. That's Serana's too. Come on, bro. Come on. I'm on you. I'm like white on rice. I'm on you. Dude. Well, there he's dead now. Oh, he's not dead. Dang. Black Soul Gem. That's dang, dude. I love nothing behind. Okay. Well. Well, now that's done. <sighs> what will you do now? I'm not sure. I'll probably stay with the Dawn Guard for as long as they'll let me. They're respectable fighters, and I think they see the benefits of having a vampire on their side now. Of course, if you've got any more adventures planned. I don't think they'll involve you. <laughs> I'd love to have you That's on. That's what I wanted to hear. I want you to turn me into a vampire. Further was saying something about vampire blood in the boat. It sounds like that's the last bit of the prophecy. The blood of a daughter of Cold Harbor can corrupt the bow. You're a daughter of Cold Harbor. So I am. I guess we could use my blood. Do you have any arrows? Elven arrows? Wait, Not hold on. Bleed on I, I don't want to. I'm going to take your blood oh. right now. All right then. So it's over. He's dead. And the prophecy dies with him. I... I suppose this is difficult for you. I think my father really died a long time ago. This was just... the end of something else. I did what needed to be done. Nothing more. I think perhaps... I think you did more than that. You have my thanks. Yeah, okay, so, development for East Run. The beast is destroyed. Not only that. But Ariel's bow is in safe hands. The Dawn Guard will now be dedicated to safeguarding it, making sure that prophecy will never come to pass. You serve Skyrim well. What are you just doing, Even with these vampires gone, the fight isn't completely over. Once we're settled back in at the Whoa. fort, there will be more work to do. We'd be honored to have you join us. That's it. I can't talk to him anymore. It's not working. Well, I guess that's it. Dang. Well. Yeah, you guys already told me what it does. Dang. That corrupts the arrow, so they won't be as strong anymore. Wait, we have to go get Serana's mother, don't we? Like, I'm sure we could go and get her. No active quest. Yeah, the quest finished. That was the end of Dawn Guard. Dang. Dang, dude. That was... Uh, 
That was it. I'm not going to lie. I like that more than than Dragonborn. I, I like that more than Dragonborn. Maybe it's because I really enjoyed Serana. I'm no fan of the sun. But it would be better than this. Maybe it's because I, I like I'm I'm just a big Serana simp, but like I really enjoyed that. I'm wondering is there a way to go back to the other Is there a way to go back for her mother? I didn't think she'd just be right here. You to have something on your mind. What is it? Harkin is dead. What? Are you certain? Yeah, we he died by my hand. And I see nothing preventing my return to Tamriel. Allow me to gather some of my things, and I'll head back to Castle Volkahar. And from the bottom of my heart, I thank you. Woo, let's go. I return to Castle Volkahar as soon as I'm finished gathering my things. Okay, we can we can head back now. We can't teleport, I don't think. Does this count as a hub world? Nope, we can't. Okay, okay. I was I was just running back, so I wasn't recording that. But Valerica literally spawned here as if she was in the castle. She literally spawned in the wrong room. That's weird. Okay, did she respawn? Yeah, she's over here now. Help yourself to anything you need in my laboratory. Ah, it's good to be home again. What will you do now? Yeah, I think it's time I got back to my work as an alchemist. The Soul Cairn will offer a unique opportunity to continue my studies, and I intend to complete my research. In the meantime, if there are any potions you might need, feel free to help yourself. Well, maybe you should clean up in here first. My God, you're sitting on all this crap. Dang. Well, I mean, that's about everything that that's in here. I mean, we kind of already looked around before, but well, that's the that's the end of the Dawn Guard DLC, man. Um, I guess to talk about, I guess to kind of do things here, um, it was better than uh, Dragonborn. Dragonborn was very cool and arguably cooler because you get to go to Solstheim, you know, but I'd still say that she teleported. I'd still say as a whole, I enjoyed this more, mostly because it felt more character driven. I mean, there were people in Solstheim, you know, we talked to and stuff like that, you know, and Mirak himself. But outside of that, it felt like more of an experience type one, while this one felt more like it was narratively driven. Like we had personal stakes in the matter. We had even more reason to take on Harkon because of what you know, he put Serana through and stuff. Not only that, you know, it was nice seeing Ver, uh, what's her name? Uh, Ver, Valerica herbs in the courtyard garden. I hope they'll grow. It was nice seeing Valerica kind of see the error of her ways. She's, she's like, because in a way she was a lot like her husband, except on the opposite spectrum. You know, she just hated him so much that it kind of ended up leaving you know their daughter in a bad spot you know but the fact that she was able to admit that and you know and really do something about a potion of blood whoa um it it, it had good character development for her you know it, it made me no longer feel resentment for her and while that might not exactly excuse the things that she's done just because she says sorry about it now but they now have an opportunity to mend their relationship and i think that's cool you know, I think that's really cool. Um, yeah, it was cool going within the Soul Cairn as well. I thought it was neat in there. I thought it was a little too big for its own good. I see why it's as big as it is. But yeah, um, I enjoyed this DLC a lot. I really did. It was really nice taking down uh, Harkon as well. He was a good boss. He had a neat gimmick of like healing himself and stuff like that. So you couldn't fully just rely on these these godly arrows or anything you kind of had to get in the mix too but yeah i mean honestly he wasn't really too big of a challenge to be honest i don't even think i really needed to heal i think i needed to heal more when i was just using the arrows but when i actually used the weapon i was practically not dying so i already killed the main vampire and everything you already you already missed it homie um but yeah it was cool that we got to kill harkon um it was really nice it brought things to a nice little close uh for their arc and it makes me really hope valerica and serana can both you know mend their relationship and um 
you know, kind of live their lives now. I mean, they're immortal, so, you know, <laughs> you know, why not? Yeah, definitely. I'd, I'd definitely give it a nine out of ten. Um, eight point five at the very lowest, only because certain parts dragged. The soul Karen part was a little um, it kind of dragged on a little bit. Um, and I also think uh, getting the waters dragged a little bit. I genuinely think it would have been much worse if I didn't have clairvoyance, which I did have. So uh, that's why I'm kind of just willing to give it a nine. If you kind of came in there prepared, it wouldn't have been bad already. Yeah, I, I already killed Harkon. Um, it's fun your channel. We can go greater entertainment. Go and check out some other videos when I run out of Skyrim videos. Hey, I appreciate that. We're going to be starting Mass Effect uh, when Skyrim is done. And speaking of Skyrim being done, this uh, I know there's still so much left of the game. I know I've explained this a lot, but I'm going to say it again here because this is the second to last episode. This is the second to last episode. There's so much more Skyrim to do. There's so many more quest lines. There's so many NPCs to meet, so many, you know, jobs and, you know, builds to have and stuff like that and quests to go on. I, I know all that. But for my first experience of Skyrim, you know, as a playthrough, self-contained playthrough on YouTube, this is where I really want to end it. You know, I, I know I some people really wanted me to go and beat Alduin already, but um, I'm kind of glad we did the DLCs first. We kind of needed to go and buff ourselves up a bit, so we definitely shouldn't have any trouble with it. I actually tried to end Skyrim a lot of episodes ago, maybe at least five or six episodes ago, if you guys might remember. But we got we got our our our, our booties handed to us. So that definitely wasn't going to happen that day. But I think we're more than prepared to take on Alduin now. I mean, we've taken down the final bosses of two of the post game DLCs, you know, so it, I definitely think Alduin himself shouldn't be too big, you know, uh, of something to worry about. Um, so, yes, in the next episode, we're going to be taking down Alduin, man. We're finally going to be taking him down um, and that will conclude the Skyrim playthrough. Um, I'll get more into it then, you know, my final thoughts of the game and everything like that as we go through the credits and stuff like that. I'll save that for next time. No, the, it's not time for the mushy stuff just yet. Um, but again, I've said it before, but we will be doing Mass Effect 1 after this game is beaten. So um, expect the reaction video. Expect As soon as that video is done, the final episode, I don't it'll probably be a witcher after that but expect a mass effect reaction then where we'll react to some of the trailers or commercials or whatever and then we'll be playing the game i'm i'm super excited for it and if you guys are just skyrim fans and stuff like that i highly recommend you check out that playthrough too you know we're gonna have a lot of fun a lot of hijinks so i'm sure you guys will enjoy and so that's gonna be it for me for now thank you all so much for watching i really appreciate all your support on this series again not too much musty stuff for now we have a dragon to kill. Thank you all so much for watching. My name is Kingdom Ace. Remember everyone to play some games, have some fun, and enjoy your day today.